Victims of crime deserve to have their rights at the heart of Scotland's justice system. At a time when a victim feels powerless and most vulnerable because of what's happened to them, it is, in my view, time to put their voices at the heart of our system. I'm Jamie Green, MSP for the West of Scotland, and I'm now consulting on draft proposal for a new Members' Bill here in the Scottish Parliament, the Victims, Criminal Justice and Fatal Accident Inquiry Scotland Bill. My new proposed law will ensure that victims' voices are heard throughout the justice process. It includes proposals to allow victims to make statements to court before sentences are handed down. Victims would also be able to make direct representation to parole hearings or, for example, where they disagree with a decision not to prosecute someone. Victims would also be able to seek exclusion zones for newly released prisoners as a condition of that offender's release. I also want to improve the victim notification scheme, which currently, in my view, is simply not fit for purpose, so that victims can access the sort of information that is important to them about the crime and about the criminal. My proposed bill will also give more rights to victims' families where their loved one has tragically died, finally putting into the statute books Michelle's Law and Suzanne's Law. Both of those are long overdue, in my opinion. Other substantial policy proposals in my bill will seek your views on the removal of the controversial not proven verdict in the Scottish ju justice system. Now, this is an issue which has been rumbling on for far too long. And finally, my proposed bill will make fatal accident inquiries mandatory and timely because I believe there are deaths at the moment where it would be in the public interest to automatically have that FOI. And let's face it, they're simply taking too long. It prolongs the agony for the loved ones. My consultation is now open. And I want to hear from as many people as possible, whatever your views. This is a substantial piece of legislation and I would appreciate your comments on the detail of it.